Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I have for us the fall, yes, it's August, when I'm filming this. I probably won't get uploaded until the 1st or 2nd of September, but it is August when I'm getting this, and a friend of, my, a friend of mine and I yesterday, just yesterday, were talking about our FabFitFunds were due in soon, and so we were super stoked because we were kind of excited about this one. But FabFitFun for summer 20, or not summer, not summer. There's leaves on here, people. This is not summer. <laughs> for fall of 2021. Now, FabFitFun is a quarterly subscription. So normally you would receive your boxes. Let's see. Um, this is really early for me. Normally, I don't normally receive my FabFitFun until mid to late September, so I'm not upset about this at all, getting this this early, and more beneficial to you guys, because you guys will be able to see this video too. I mean, I've already seen quite a few FabFitFun uh, videos. Um, I did customize this. And that is a perk of an annual subscriber, so if you pay annually which is just under $200 because you do receive some savings if you pay annually. But if you pay um, quarterly, it is $50 a quarter and you, you still get to customize. Annual members get to customize the entire box and the quarterly members get to customize four, I think, four items in the box um, and they'll send out an email. And also we will get, as an annual subscriber, you get a, um, you're, you're bumped up to the top of the class, the, the front of the line for choosing. And if you're a quarterly subscriber, you get to choose after all annual members have had, have that window of opportunity first. So when I started this, I didn't, I didn't start as an annual subscriber. I started out as a quarterly subscriber and I just never, um, I never got around to customizing. So I always forget, which was fine. I enjoyed what they had in there, but now I kind of want to customize. So this is what our box looks like. Hold on here. And they have, they have their catalog, which feast on fall flavors and your pug, pumpkin themed bucket list is two articles in here. The summer box or the spring box was one that they changed up how they were doing this. So it was slightly, um, a little bit confusing. So let's see if I can find the, I did get an add on on this one. So paper, paper, what's this? Hello fresh. That's a staple in their boxes. And what's this one? Bright sellers. Okay. What's this one? Oh, this is the referral. Everybody gets a referral code. So if you um, send the referral code to your friends and they use this, they get $15 off their FabFitFun, their first FabFitFun box. Okay, well, I don't see the separate pamphlet. Just make sure I'm not gonna squish anything over there. So I'm just gonna dig into it. First thing is one that I customized. This is the ceramic Dutch oven. Um, or is it, is it ceramic? No, it's enamel, the enamel Dutch oven. And it's a painted enamel. It's a beautiful blue color. I thought it was gorgeous. So it didn't look to be too terribly big, but it did look to be big enough for um, 
like macaroni and cheese or maybe mashed potatoes or green bean casserole or something like that. So that is what this looks like. And inside there, this is golden rabbit enamelware. So that is this. Isn't that pretty? Pretty bright blue. And all wrapped up in paper was the lid. So there we go. So it's not too big, but let's see if it says the size does not say a size, but it is definitely big enough for some, like a macaroni and cheese or mashed potatoes. Um, enough for, enough for at least, I think, I would think at least two people, if not three. And this you can stovetop broil, bake, grill, and you can cut in here. And it is dishwasher safe and there's no BPA. Awesome! Let's see if I can find that. Real quick, if I can't find these, they don't have a page in here that shows what the other choices were and doesn't show any more about this. So I liked I liked that aspect of that bit fun. I liked that they gave us a page or two with just all of the choices that were in here. They divided it up by which ones were in each category of first choice and then the second pick and then the third pick. And then they also divided up color coded it between the annual members get to choose these, the quarterly members get to choose these type of thing. So, and then of course more about that, the information about those items. So, but yeah, this I couldn't do as an add-on. So I chose this one. What is in this thing? Be honest I'm not I don't drink beer for one my husband will drink this but this is a zero alcohol Heineken and it's a mini can this is a eight ounce this is a why are you sending this especially even though it says 21 and over on this so why would you send this um, there, 5.1 fluid ounce can. Won't be able to see it, but it's right there. So this is a 5 ounce can. No. Don't. No. So there's that. Okay, and then another choice item that you could have received was the Amica the bond repair shampoo and this and conditioner in this and these are um, eight fluid ounces and eight and a half fluid ounces and I am running low on my shampoo and conditioner so I thought I would try these out next up we have from Alterna caviar anti-aging Replenishing Moisture CC Cream. Okay. Multi-benefit treatment for complete moisture, shine, smoothness, softness, UV protection, manageability, strength, anti-breakage, heat protection, and light hold. So this is this is a leave-in conditioner, by the way. I'm sorry. If, I, if that wasn't obvious, this is a leave-in conditioner. 
and this is a 3.4 fluid ounce conditioner. Okay, that was a pick. There was, there's one thing in here that I just did surprise me, so. Um, this one is the Mad Skin Care Glycolic Age Diffusing Cleanser. And I am up in the older generations, not the elderly generations yet, but I'm up in the older generations. So that's what that looks like. So I figured I may as well get the anti-aging and uh, try to keep this looking pretty. But this is to spend small amount and mix with tepid water, gently massage in a circular motion until a lather has formed, rinse with tepid water and avoid contact with eyes. So I imagine this is gentle enough for every day. So we'll try that bad boy out. <clears throat> What's next from Ren Clean Skin Care? This is their Ever Calm Global Protection Dry Cream. Clean to skin and clean to planet. So that is what this looks like. Okay, and this would be a good enough for every day. And this is a 1.7 fluid ounce. Just a little pump lid there. Two more items in my box. Here I have a instant lifting serum from Rodeol. This is their pink, pink diamond instant lifting serum. Okay, and this is a one ounce container. And this is a best results use twice daily with your moisturizer. Okay, and then the last thing in my box is this, and this is a food and drink after dinner. Where did I put my knife? A food and drink after dinner. 120 food and drink questions. A selection of the finest trivia for foodies. Okay, this is what I got in my surprise me because I, I wasn't really excited about any of it. Anyways, this is what these looks like. And they've just got questions. Um, what is the name for a sausage on a stick coated in batter and deep fried? A corn dog. So they are with flip sides. This one is, are appetizers usually served before or after a meal? Before a meal. So just, what convenience was introduced to tea making in 1908 by a New Yorker named Thomas Sullivan? The tea bag. What is the name of grape-based brandy which originates from Peru and Chile. Pisco? Pisco? Alright, so some interesting new um, questions. And here's the box. So they just slip in there and pick one and ask the question. And whoever answers it wins that card, I guess. So. So, yeah, so in here they do give you when the sales, the sale windows are. So for the fall edit sale for annual members starts October 7th over here. And for seasonal members, it starts on the 14th of October right there. So that's kind of what I mean about the annual members get first dibs, first come, first serve on that. Okay, so art in action. Sorry, I just had to cough and now my eyes are all watery. Art in action is the charity that they are going to be donating to for all donations made between July 27th and October 22nd. Okay, so this was part of one of the choices. 
he had a jump rope and three months of classes, I guess. Um, this is one of them, a backpack that's foldable. One of them, a Dose & Co. Pure Collagen that you can use in, in recipes like a pumpkin spice collagen latte or banana bread bars. Um, so, and there's my shampoo and conditioner that I chose. And then for the curly haired ladies, they had a special pattern beauty curl gel. And then this is the uh, leave-in conditioner here. And then they had some candles. Um, they had this clock thing, which was in the mix with this. Then they had the Dutch oven. They also had a skillet here. And then they had a charcuterie board there. Those are other choices. Don't need another skillet. So, oh, that's nice though. At least you have a step-by-step how-to in which order would is best. And then for the Mad Skincare, gives you a little how to figure out what your skin type is. It's good information. Okay, yeah, and these were other choices. Coach necklace and earrings set. These boot socks in a black and gray color. This belt bag or fanny pack or shoulder bag, crossbody bag, whatever. I don't need any of those. Um, and I have plenty of socks for that. <clears throat> An electric toothbrush. I have one of those. Not needed for me. And that looks to be about it for what they had in here, which isn't everything at all. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I'm debating this fall is my, um, winter is my renew period. So I'm debating as to whether or not I'm going to continue with Have Good Fun. It's kind of a bummer. I have another quarterly lifestyle box that's very similar that I get that I pay for also. So I might drop this one and keep that one for a little bit. Or I might be on the lookout for a new one. I don't know. Let me know in your comments down below. What do you think of this box? Um, I do like the Dutch oven. This is one that I definitely wanted to have. So I do like this. And then I needed, I needed the shampoo and conditioner. So these two were definite. I did choose this because I have long hair and I try to keep it healthy so I do use leave-in conditioners quite often um, like I said with this one I chose this one because I'm getting old and you know we all should take care of our face make us look as well as we can for as long as we can because thanks society um, this one I don't remember I think this was in the I think this was in one of the end, um, the, their, their last choice is different. Now you have a choice, they have bundles. So you have three different items in each bundle. They had like four choices of those, two different items in each bundle. They had about three or four choices of those. And then they had single items and the single items of course were the higher price items. I think this 
might have been one of the single um, items in that last one, which I might have done the surprise me because I think what I wanted wasn't available or what I wanted out of those, I didn't like the other thing that came with it, really. So, but yeah. But this is a day cream, so, you know, we could use these too. Um, this, I don't really need a new serum. I don't remember what choice was with this, but yeah, I mean, it's a pretty packaging, but I'm not, I'm not really into this one as much. And this isn't me, but everything else in that category was kind of at me. So, might just pop that down on the dining room table and the kids can just play with that all the time. I don't know. And I do not understand why they sent this. I don't get it. I don't. I mean, this would be cool. This would be cooler in a snack box. Or, but even though it's non-alcoholic, it's still beer. And I'm not a beer person at all. I've never liked the taste of it. And I grew up with it in the house. Um, well, my father didn't drink it, but aunts and uncles. So it was a constant smell. I've, I've plenty acclimated to the smell. I've never liked the smell or taste of it. So yeah, I'm not, no. I mean, it's cute. If I was a collector, that would be a different story, but I, no, no. So let me know what you guys think. Um, do you think I should keep going another quarter? Do you think I should keep it going for another year? Do you suppose maybe I drop it and switch it out for something else? Um, I'm not terribly excited. Not necessarily everything in there is exciting, but just the things that we were choosing from wasn't too terribly exciting. It was really difficult for me to make a choice on quite a few things just because it was, well, I need this, but, eh. So that's my, that's my vote for the fall fat food fun. Darn it. Darn it. I like this box. I, this is the longest box besides Stitch Fix that I've received. And that's kind of a bummer. But, oh well. To be determined, I haven't, I haven't made up my mind yet. So... Maybe we'll see it around later. Maybe not. I don't know. But I will see you guys around later. And I hope you did enjoy this video. Even my little rantings. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And we'll catch you next time. I hope everybody has a wonderful rest of your day. Bye.